Welcome to the Cosmic Video Tutorials. This video will be about downloading the Cosmic data files. All the data from Cosmic is available to download and this can be done in several ways depending on the size of the file you want. From the main pages on the website, such as the sample page, you can download selected data relevant to what you're looking at on the website. You can download these in CSV or TSV format. If you want complete data sets then you need to go to the downloads page. This allows you to see which file will be most relevant and provides instructions on how to download. In order to see information on all the files that are available, it is best to log in first. Then you can click on each of the file names to see further details. If you're interested in a specific gene, sample or cancer type, then you can download a subset of the complete data filtered by a variable as a CSV file directly from this page. Alternatively, you may require all the data for your analysis, in which case you will want to access our SFTP server. The data stored on the SFTP server can be accessed in one of two ways, either using a GUI client or directly via the command line. Here we will talk through utilising a GUI client, which can be a more user-friendly method. GUI clients include WinSCP, FileZilla or CyberDuck. In order to log in, you will require the hostname of the SFTP server the port and the email address and password that you registered with on the website. The host name and port can be found here from the downloads page. In order to connect, open your GUI client. We are using CyberDuck. First, you need to open a new connection and then fill in the details of the server, sftp-cancer.sanger.ac.uk. Email address as the username and then your password. Once the connection is established, you will see four directories. Choose COSMIC and then whichever genome reference you want. We will select GRCH38. From here, you can select cell lines, complete COSMIC or whole genome screens. Within each folder, you can then download the files from the current release and the last 10 releases. Clicking on the current release allows us to see the files that you might want to download. For demonstration purposes, we will quickly download the COSMIC readme. Simply double click on the file to download it. If you're unsure which file you need, you can check the contents of each of the files on the downloads page as we saw previously, using the file description drop down. This provides a list of the contents of each file with an explanation of what each column label means. Thank you for watching this Cosmic Video tutorial. We hope that it was helpful. If you have any further questions, please contact our help desk.